Major legal victory for a San Diego family and their decades old struggle to recover a $20 million painting confiscated by the Nazis. Team 10 investigator Michael Chen is joining us now with why the painting's current owner says the Jewish family lost their claim to the painting. Michael. And this is a look at that masterpiece, a French impressionist painting of a Parisian street painted in 1897 by the famed Camille Pissarro. Its value is sky high, but one local family says reclaiming it is also about reclaiming a legacy and correcting an injustice. In this photo taken in the 1920s, you can see the Pissarro painting hanging on the wall of the home of Lily Kassir. In 1939, months before the war officially began, Lily's Jewish family was forced to flee Germany. A Nazi appraiser said she could go but had to leave her painting behind, had to give it to him. And so she did that. That saved her life. The Kassir family attorney says after the war, Lily tried but couldn't locate the painting and accepted about $13,000 in restitution from the German government. Lily died in 1962. In 2000, her sole heir, San Diego Cloud Kassir, discovered the painting was hanging in a Spanish museum placed there by a German art collector. Claude sued to recover it, but a court dismissed the suit by striking down a new state law allowing the recovery of lost art dating back as far as a century. A federal appeals court just reversed that decision, paving the way for a civil trial. We are just really pleased. Michael Sondak is president of the Jewish Federation of San Diego County, a plaintiff in the suit after it was named an heir by Claude who has passed away. He says this battle is about recovering not just a piece of art, but recovering the legacy of generations of Jews wiped out by the Nazis. You can't rebuild it. It's not possible. But every single effort to recover a piece of that life is for the families and through them for the Jewish people quite important. The Kassirers want to right the wrong that was done to their family in 1939. Cloud has two children. His 93-year-old widow, Beverly, still lives in San Diego. Lawyers for the Spanish Museum point to the $13,000 restitution accepted by the family, but the family says that money doesn't mean they gave up ownership of the painting if and when it was found. Michael Chen, 10 News.